Hello everyone and welcome to this video. Last Sunday, the 11th of July, Richard Branson has flown to space together with Teresa Bandler, Colin Bennett, Beth Moses and the two pilots David Mackay and Michael Masuki. They flew with the with Virgin Galactic's um, VSS Unity and that's, that's a space plane carried by uh, White Knight 2, an airplane that consists of two fuselages and the space plane is connected between those two, two fuselages. As you can see we lift it off and it is very difficult to bring this plane to uh, 9,000 meters to 9 kilometers altitude so that's the altitude when you drop the when you drop VSS Unity in Kerbal Space Program in real life it's of course a bit higher and yeah I'm not a huge fan of uh, space tourism but I think the tech and the team behind it is very cool. It looks futuristic but uh, it has kind of old uh, parts in it. For example the rudders are connected with cables to the joysticks and not with the electric motors. So the uh, the vehicle has no autonomous control. Um, it is flown the whole the whole flight from by the two pilots. And we are now at 8 kilometers. You can download this craft in the description of this video. And if you want, you can install the Halcam mod that gives you those cameras. Now we now drop the uh, space plane with action group 2 and we light the engine with action group 1. As soon as we gain up speed uh, the vehicle is pitching up as you can see and at the end you want to fly almost vertical. Then you need to pump fuel from the tank that's not draining automatically to the other tanks. After the uh, about one minute long burn, uh, the engine shuts down and the vehicle goes into the feather flight mode with action group 3 to unlock the feathers and to with action group 4 to move them. Then we fall back to carbon and we are unlocking the feathers again and put them into the flight mode. We are now flying to the runway, so that's no uh, powered flight anymore. And now it has touched down. And there they are, on the ground again. Now we fly back our uh, White Knight 2 carrier aircraft
And then I noticed that one gear, landing gear was not working. So the touchdown kind of failed, <laughs> but all pilots stayed alive. So if you like this video, please leave a like and I would be happy if you subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.